top 10 reasons why everyone is moving to Las Vegas. Should you? And that's what we're talking about today. So let's roll. Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And I'm her sidekick, Damian Barton. Today we're gonna to talk about 10 reasons why everyone wants to move to Las Vegas. But before we get started, make sure you hit that like, and most importantly, subscribe to my channel. And if you need a real estate agent and you wanna buy, give me a call at 702-370-5112. All right, let's get started. When people think of Las Vegas, the first thing that comes to mind is the Las Vegas Strip. Known for its glitzy casinos and vibrant nightlife. While it's true that Las Vegas is a world-renowned tourist destination, it's also a fantastic place to call home. I have been a local resident for over 30 plus years. And Damien, how long have you been a resident? Off and on for over 20 years. And we love this city and we don't see ourselves leaving it one bit right yeah exactly nope i plan on dying here <laughs> <laughs> just kidding anyways so today we're gonna go over the top 10 reasons why everyone is moving to las vegas mm -hmm. and the first reason is the most obvious one and that is no, no state, state income tax, tax. And this is such a great advantage. Now there are a handful of other states across the country that does not have state income tax, but the best part is not only do we have no state income tax, but our property taxes tend to be a lot lower than those other no state income tax states. Mm -hmm, you great. know what I mean? Like Texas, their state income taxes is expensive. Seattle, Washington, mm -hmm. property taxes expensive. So no state income tax is one of the number one reasons why people like to relocate here. Number two is entertainment. And Las Vegas is known for its world-class entertainment. From casinos and nightclubs to concerts and shows, there's always something to do in Las Vegas, no, no matter what you're interested in. Like the saying goes, what happens in Vegas stays, stays in, in Vegas. Vegas. Yeah, baby. <laughs> and number three is warm weather year round. Yes, granted we do have very hot summers, but July is mostly the hottest Oof. month yeah. of the year. And then, you know, once December hits, it's beautiful normally. Mm -hmm. And we've had a little El Nino effect. <laughs> but January, February, March, April, May, the weather is in the 60s and 80s. And then we have a very hot summer and then we start tapering down. So we have warm weather year round. We do. We do have some cold winters and December tends to be the coldest. Um, but once after December and January hits, it's like spring. Mm -hmm. Number four, easy access to other destinations. Las Vegas is a major transportation hub. It has direct flights to other major cities and it's also within driving distance to several national parks and other popular tourist destinations. Yeah, I mean, we're in the middle of it. We're super close to California, we're close to Arizona, we're close to Utah, four to five hours and each. So we're like right in the middle. So it's a perfect destination. And we have international flights. We have one of the best international airports here. And a lot of people like that because they can fly internationally to other countries. Uh -huh. And number five, retirement friendly. Las Vegas is a popular retirement destination. And we have over say 20 different types of retirement communities here in the Las Vegas Valley, where you can enjoy easy, beautiful lifestyle with club amenities, swimming pools, um, and live a beautiful, active adult lifestyle. Perfect, and number six, it's family friendly. Las Vegas has a lot to offer families from parks, museums, and lots of other fun family activities to do here in Las Vegas. Yeah, stay tuned. We will be doing the top 10 things to do with kids on the Strip and then a video on the top 10 things to do with kids off the strip. Mm. So it's very family friendly oriented, especially a lot of these master plan communities where they have plethora of parks, fitness centers, 
you name it, they have it all around the family. And number seven is diversity. Las Vegas is a diverse city with people from all over the world calling it home. So just because also we have that international airport I was telling you about, people from all over the world's families can come visit them. Yeah, right. Right? <laughs> so very diverse city, uh, very cultural city. We have mm -hmm. different types of cultures here in the valley. Number eight on the list is it's close to nature. And Las Vegas is surrounded by natural beauty, including mountains, deserts, and canyons. Mm -hmm. And there are many activities and opportunities to enjoy the outdoor living around the Las Vegas area. Yeah, and right next to Summerlin, you have Red Rock Canyon. Just down the way towards the Northwest, you have Mount Charleston. Then you have Lake Mead, Hoover Dam. We have tons of outdoor activities for everyone. And number nine is great food scene. Las Vegas is home to a variety of restaurants from casual eateries to fine dining establishments. There's something for everyone in Las Vegas, whether you're craving Italian food, Mexican food, Asian food, or whatever, we have it all. Fusion. And on the Strip, they have it all. But throughout the Valley, not just on the Strip, there's tons of awesome restaurants here in Las Vegas. And we tend to explore and eat a lot. We do, we do. <laughs> We're very fortunate to, uh, we like the food. For sure, Vegas has a lot to offer in that department. And Damon was very sheltered until he met me. <laughs> I just, I like my. All he ate was Chipotle, <laughs> Chipotle, and what else? Chipotle, Chipotle, <laughs> and raising canes. And raising canes. Yes. <laughs> so I had to, you know, get him out of that shell and, and let him explore some awesome eateries here in the valley. Delicious. <laughs> Number ten on the list is Major League Sports Teams. And Las Vegas has really improved in this department over the years. From the Golden Knights to the Raiders, we're also gonna get the A's yep. here soon. Uh, we also have the women's basketball team. Yep. Uh, we, we're very fortunate to have a wide variety of amazing sports teams. Yeah, I remember back in the 90s, the only major sports teams we had was UNLV. Mm -hmm. yeah, <laughs> That's the all everyone was talking about the Rebels when mm -hmm. Tartanian or whatever was the coach and they were so big back then and that's all we had and a lot of times because of our gambling they didn't want to bring the major sports teams and our first real major sport team was the Golden Knights you mm -hmm. know the Vegas Golden Knights and they brought home a Stanley Cup mm -hmm. then you had the women's NBA then we went to the Raiders and mm -hmm. now we're getting the Oakland A's so we're finally a, a major city you know a big little city yeah mm -hmm. Stepping up. Yep, we're stepping up. Now these are just a few reasons why people are moving to Las Vegas. If you're looking for a city that offers something for everyone, mm -hmm. then Las Vegas definitely has you covered. This place has it all. Yeah, and that's just the top 10. We got more. There's more reasons why, but you know, we can't just cover it. You know, we have to make these videos a little short so you can stay tuned. Because <laughs> once we get to past the 10 mark, minute mark or so, you're like, eh. <laughs> Gotta keep your attention going, right? Anyway, folks, if you are thinking about relocating or moving here to Las Vegas and buying a home, you can always give me a call at 702-370-5112. But most importantly, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to my channel, folks, because I love talking about this awesome city, not only the city, but the neighborhoods that Las Vegas Valley has to offer. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we can't wait to see you on the next one.